we continue to follow breaking news tonight, Dylan Thomas is in Estes Park where crews are still searching for that plane after reports of a crash near the Kruger wildfire. Dylan. Uh, Karen, we are actually starting to hear a potential update on that, that they may have now located that crash on the side of the Kruger Rock Mountain area. We are still working to confirm that, but earlier today, this video here shot by Mark Nitro, one of our photojournalists, shows what we believe was the aircraft that was circling uh, the fire here in Estes Park. As we learned, the uh, we did learn that the tail of the plane, uh, the number on it, did match what we were actually seeing on the flight tracker system as well, which showed that a plane took off from Loveland, came out here to the Loveland area circled several times and then never returned to the Loveland base that it did take off from. Earlier tonight, several police vehicles and firefighters were making their way here to the scene, going up the mountainside to continue that search. Once again, the update we have with you is as of now, we are hearing that they may have located that wreckage. We don't have any further information beyond that, and we will continue to try and bring you any updates that we may receive throughout the night, as well as on CBS4 this morning. Reporting live in Estes Park, Dylan Thomas covering Colorado first.